entail doing this as kind of a preface to this game here. This is a trigger warning. This game does contain some serious themes and may be triggering to some viewers. Please keep this in mind. I hope to see you in the Let's Play. Hello, everyone, and welcome. Welcome to Let's Play The Suffering with Frozen Foxy. The first Halloween special that I have done in years. Welcome to the 2022 Halloween special. I'm both nervous and excited about this because I haven't really played any horror games uh, since uh, probably the last time that I played something on the channel, so I'm vaguely nervous because uh, I don't know that I'm up to snuff for this with all my my rust <laughs> as far as a game player goes I don't know so let's play on impossible no um, I'll, I'll definitely do medium I think I would die miserably on impossible done this and I still hate it I swear Abbott's full enough already <laughs> at least when you escort an inmate to death row you know he's scheduled to get what he deserves Ernesto, you can really be a jackass, you know that? But you hear what this one did? I don't want to know, and you know what I'm He did his ex-wife to a bloody pulp. Killed her with his fists. Look, I said I didn't- Then he drowned one son in the tub, and threw the other out a window. Don't ask me to cry for him. Whew. Inmate, is this true? Oh, he won't say. Claims he blacked the whole thing out. <laughs> a likely story. The needle's too good for him. Filthy inmate, they should all die. Either looks really veiny or really hairy up top. I don't know what's going on exactly. <laughs> Willie's bed isn't even cold yet, and already they brought in a new guy. I heard he killed his old lady and kids. Sick motherfucker. Be quiet, you jerry curled fool. Don't you know who that is? Why should I? That's Torque, the man himself. Word is he sheared half the Aryan Brotherhood over at Easton. So fucking what? I can understand a guy killing his old lady, but he popped his kids too. Motherfucker deserves to be strapped down and dosed. You believe what the COs tell you, Slick? You don't know shit about the man. I'm telling you, what I heard, he's all right. That cocksucker's not gonna be all right for long if he's in the row with the rest of us short timers. Shut your cracker ass, Goose. Man's do respect. You show him respect. I decide who I respect, shit boy. Don't you go tell me. Get out of there. Some of you want to go back on the loaf? I didn't think so. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Neighbor. Nice to meet you. My name's Floyd. How long you got to get turned on the table, huh? You all out of appeals? Your lawyer fuck you? I read about your trial. They got no witnesses, all circumstantial evidence. No one knows what really happened but you. But you can't remember a thing, is that right? Best not to listen to him talk. Floyd's a degenerate parasite. They should have slapped the cuffs on him coming out of his mama's At least tongue. I know Jesus is with me, man. Whatever I've done, the Reverend says Jesus has forgiven me. Will you shut the fuck up, you baby-raping, sodomizing sack of shit? I was just asking the man a question, Goose. Whoa. What the fuck shit, is this shit? It's an earthquake. What the hell's going on? The intel. CO. You gotta let us out. We're still humans, man. The whole we got fucking rubbed. place is coming down. Sweet Jesus, what the hell was that? Slick, you okay, man? Is the prison collapsing? How are we sinking into the ocean? CO! CO! What the hell is going on? Oh, he real slick now. Slick. Slick and slimy. What in the fuck just yep. happened? Slick. Slick. Goose, you still there? Yeah, I'm still here. And it wasn't me. If that's what you're thinking, I didn't touch that. What was that? No, nope, we got two slicks. Oh, for fuck's sake, what's going on? That was close. I thought we were done for. We gotta get out of this shit can before it collapses. What, what was shit. close? There's something in here. It's in here! Help me! Torque's over here like, ah, oh, man, finally, peace and quiet. Maybe I can go to sleep. Okay. 
It, uh, it appears that something opened our cage. It, it was moving real fast, and it slashed the middle of the bars. So this, this door is literally split in half. Interesting. All right, so, uh, our, uh, our nice cell here says, uh, end of the line on the wall, DXO2. Oh, look, we've got our own private little, uh, toilet here and a sink. This place is paradise. A lot of people screaming and shooting in the background here. Man, you look like you had a fun time over here. Inmate! What back the? in your cell! Everything's under control! Uh, sure! Sure it's under control. Hey, wait, how did he use his hat? Did, wasn't the knife, like, going through his hat? What is that drip? Oh. Um, apparently he's dripping from up there somewhere. <laughs> How did his hat fall off, though? <laughs> That's what I want to know. The knife, like, went straight through his hat and into his head. I don't, I don't feel like... Unless the knife was just, like, stabbed so much uh, uh, to the side that there was just, like, a hole through it. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like we're being led, though, because uh, that door got open and now this door got open for us. Oh, hi. There's, uh... Nice bit of, uh, material on the walls here. Like, uh, kitties. There's lots of kitties over here. I'm pretty sure that's what this stuff is. Kitties everywhere. <laughs> oh, you weren't, you weren't quite dead. <laughs> Sorry, Slick. Too bad. Alright. Mouse button one to attack, huh? Alright, we got, we got a little, little shiv thing. This... This is not very little, actually. This thing looks like uh, uh, we took we took part of a building using it. Well, now I definitely feel like I'm being led around. Everything is just opening for us on purpose right now. All right, so let's let's uh, let's get a load of the controls here. That makes me walk. That doesn't make me duck. That's a first-person mode. Interesting. Why do I feel like I have less uh, range when I'm in first-person? This looks like this is just a front stab versus a full slash up front. I kind of like the first-person mode, though. It, uh, it certainly gets you straight into the action here. Hello? Are you up there still, sir? Ooh, the Kool-Aid's a little warm. Don't want any of that. Sir, sir, you called like three seconds ago. It's 30 minutes or less, not five seconds or less. Can't deliver pizzas this fast. Ridiculous. So, uh, we can enter the security monitors, apparently. Ah, yes, a very staticky- whoa, hello, security monitor. Apparently there was a, uh, a monster standing in the middle of this room. I like that the, uh, oh, it's like blinking around the room at random. I like that the monsters in this game basically have big knives for hands and feet. Does it does it ever show up again? Is it gonna like come and attack me if I stay on this uh, this camera too long? All right, you know what? I don't like Five Nights at Freddy's, so we're just gonna move on. Well, looks like those. I was about to say it looks like those guys are holding out, but never mind. Holy crap! They're all messed up now. God damn. It was instant. Maybe it was that uh, fast one that uh, that slashed my cage open. All right, what else we got in here? We kind of look at maps. All right. 
So we can look at maps. That's a little slow to come up. Oh, hey, we can actually see where we're at on the map, too. We're in the, uh, the control station for the D block over here, the douchebag block, I'm sure. Uh, we've got some showers, electrical, administration, to an east walkway, maintenance, control station, level A, locker room. So there's a couple of stairways out of here. This, uh, this sheet looks super, super tiny. So I can use the mouse wheel to zoom, apparently. All right. That still doesn't really help. I can, I can tell that it says corrections. I think that's Maryland State Department. Gosh, this is like words for ants right now. I can't read any of this crap like some uh, extra extra good magnification. Do I really have to act, click to move this? That sucks. I was hoping I could drag. That's uh, haha, a drag. Okay. Um, wow, that map takes forever to load. So we've got a witness area, a G chamber. That's, uh, that's where the OGs go to, right? The L chamber. That's uh, that's where you get the liquor, I, I guess. <laughs> we got the witness area next to the uh, the L chamber, so you can uh, witness someone getting drunk, I guess. Seems good. Got the uh, the foyer here, witness processing, another witness area, the E chamber. That's uh, that's where Mega Man gets refills. Uh, infirmary, visitor area, control station and to B level. So are we on B level or are we on C level? What, what exactly are we on? So this says A level here. Um, that means that we're probably on B level. I don't like the fact that the, the map here is labeled death house, first floor, death house, second floor. By the way, I thought we were in a prison death house. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is definitely definitely B level here. So we only have two levels to this, uh, this prison to actually go search out. It, uh, doesn't look too huge. We can, uh, we can go investigate this entire area pretty quickly. I'm sure. Ah, locker. What we got in here? Are those Duracells? Those are totally batteries. All right. The Energizer Bunny is somewhere out there for us. He's going to help us with our mission. So do we have like a, a flashlight or something? Like, let's see. Flashlight. That is definitely not flashlight. Just, you know, clicking around. Uh, oh, okay. So we can, uh, and go look at uh, the photo of our family here. Apparently, we decided to take it with us. That's good. That's good. Can I zoom in on it? No. Can't. Can't flip it around. Can only escape. Why is it saying left click to select a map? This is a photo, not a map. Come on, game. All right. Flashlight. Flashlight. That's not a flashlight. Um. What is this? Clem's notebook. There's a random gun, some dynamite, bullets. Okay. Can't click. I've got an exit to return to main menu. Um, hmm. Does that mean I have to use the keyboard for this? Yes. Consuela's journal. Is she going to tell us that Superman isn't here later? Is that is that what's going to happen? No, no. <laughs> Uh, all right, so I guess I have to use the keyboard to move around. I can't pick anything else. This is, uh, this is a bit of a strange menu. Let's see if we can look in the notebook here. Contained in these pages are my observations of the bizarre creatures that have appeared on Carnate Island since the cataclysm struck. The creatures emerge in a variety of ways, but many of them appear to come from within the island itself, as if the very earth of Carnate were poisonous and vile. Though I scarcely have time to keep a journal like this while trying to keep myself alive, my inquisitive nature forces me to write down what I see in the hope that I might better understand it. But how can this unspeakable horror possibly be understood? It is as if Carnet's horrific sins, both past and present, are being brought to life in a pageant of death. 
Wow, this guy really likes to uh, to alliterate. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, can I can I click around? Also, who the hell's journal is this? Why do we have it? Why do we have Consuela's journal as well? Like, we just came into a prison. Did our box contain this stuff? I don't think so, because we're already talking about creatures. Where did we get this information? Can I can I do anything with this? Oh, page locked. Okay, so there's not many pages in here. This looks like there's someone's coffee stain on this one. People really need to be careful with their books. Interesting. I wonder if this uh, the fact that there's random smudges in places means anything. I don't think so. Because this is literally the same page. Did you guys think I wouldn't notice that you just flipped the JPEG for this page? Come on, man. <laughs> All right. Contain. Oh, I didn't realize he was going to read it again. So do I just hit escape? Okay. Um, all right, let's see what the uh, cleaning lady has to say. When Ernesto took his job at Abbott, I was far from excited. When he told me we would need to move to Carnate Island as well, I was not happy at all. But I tried to find a good side to the situation. I have always been interested in the history of unique places. What kind of history would we find on Carnate? This scrapbook project was started primarily to fill my time here, but also so I could record what I had discovered. In my exploration of the island, I uncovered many of Carnate's secrets. Though I record them here, I do not think I will tell the world about what I have found. Carnate is a place whose secrets are best kept to itself. So, uh, we basically have, uh, The Rock here. At some point, uh, Sean Connery is going to show up, I'm sure. <laughs> we're, we're in a random prison. Uh, I, I think it's called Abbott, and it's on an island called Carnate Island. Uh, so we can, uh, we can... Probably pick up some carne asada somewhere. Sounds good. Abbott State Penitentiary. Originally okay. built as part of Fort Mallison to house German POWs during World War II, it was taken over by Maryland following the war and converted into Abbott State Penitentiary. Mostly built out of local quarry rock, the prison is now home to nearly 1,000 inmates and has the worst safety record and highest homicide rate of any prison in the Maryland Department of Corrections system. The state also carries out the majority of its death sentences here. You know, I'm going to guess that the reason that there are a really high amount of homicides is there are creatures with knife hands and feet walking around the prison. That probably would cause a lot of homicides to occur. At least, I think so. I, I mean, I could be wrong. So we've got a view of the front gate here, a view from a guard tower, and a cell block. That is a uh, that's a much bigger cell block than the one that uh, that we were in. It looks like it has at least two floors, possibly three. Not not entirely sure. Getting uh, getting some vibes from uh, from some other cell blocks that I've been in in various games throughout the years. Is that it? Okay. I'm, I'm surprised that there's a random page that's locked in between the pages that are unlocked. This is a really, really strange journal system. <laughs> I do not understand this. I don't know where we got these journals from. Obviously, they just came out of nowhere. Very odd. Very, very odd. 